I want to start off first and foremost by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Raka Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who taught me this truth and who lead as examples to the flock. Salutations to the elect, starting with the 144,000, as well as the men, women, and children whom the Lord has foreordained to be a part of that large multitude, to receive mercy to Yahweh Shai and his sacrifice, and to wake up you know, to who we are as a people, you know, to come back repenting. You know, to Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, you know, receiving the Holy Spirit. This lesson is going to be a response to the um, the Ella brother Rakhara comes video that you see here on the screen, false messiahs and falsehoods. You know, and the brother brought out some really beautiful points in this lesson. Also, you know, brought out you know a lot of you know videos on social media and the news, you know, that are um, pretty much um, deifying. You know. Um, Trump, you know, pretty much now Trump is 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 has been given the rubber stamp of approval. You know, he has survived an assassination. You know, the um the so-called black community has embraced and uh, and accepted him now as as a gangster, as a thug. You know, they, I, I've seen um videos on social media about you know, I'm not sure if this is real. I doubt it's real. You know, with him walking onto stage and they're playing Fifty Cent, many men wish death upon me so you know they've accepted him he's now a thug he's gotten shot at he's um you know he 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 he's officially black they've given him the rubber stamp of approval you know christians are saying you know god god's hand was over trump that day and protected him and you know all, and all the news media are pretty much they, they're all saying the same thing you know the brother brought out some clips here in this video you know from another youtube channel where they're it's pretty much showing you right that all these news media are reading from a script and all the script is the same so pretty much we, we, we can see the narrative you know trump is being set up you know as the savior of america you know the um the the, the, the champion against the um the far right you know the champion against the deep state you know he's um he's the, the savior of the american people the american economy you know from um from the globalists and you know all that nonsense you know and our people of course have fallen into that trap you know, because they're, they're, they're so easily misled, you know, thinking, no, because first they thought that it was Biden, you know. I remember Taraji P. Henson, you know, during the um, the 2020, the, the 2019, you know, campaigning, because he started his term in 2020, right. Taraji P. Henson was like, save us, Joe, save us. And the reason why everybody in the black community, you know, kind of embraced him was because he was, um, he was um, Obama's vice president. You know, so if, if he's close to Obama, you know, Obama is this shining star, you know, then he must be good, you know, for, for, for Jake. But now they see that, you know, this man is, is, is senile, this man is not it. You know, the, the country is falling apart. You know, America has no respect on the world stage. No, no, they say, you know, it, it's, it's Trump. It's got to be Trump. So now our people are falling, you know, in line behind Trump, right? Saying that, you know, Trump is going to be, you know, the, um, the new savior. You know, but we who are in this truth, we who have woken up, you know, to who we are as a people. We should be only looking to Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai for deliverance. This is Psalm 62 and verse 6. He only, but I thought, let me start from verse um, verse 5. It says, My soul, wait thou upon Yahweh, for my expectation is from him, not from Trump, not from Biden, not from any other presidential candidate that might come, right? Not from Elon Musk. Here in Jamaica, not from, you know, um, our Prime Minister Andrew Holness. No, no, no mortal man. No other gods, no, none of these um, false idols of the other nations, right? Wait only upon Yahweh, for my expectation is from him. He, is, he only is my rock and my salvation he is my defense. I shall not be moved. In Yahweh is my salvation and my glory, the rock of my strength and my refuge is in Yahweh. The trust in him. At all times, ye people, pour out your heart before him. Yahweh is a refuge for us. Selah. Right? Surely men of low degree are vanity. And men of high degree are a lie. Right? All these different politicians and, uh, and billionaires that you see in the, um, in, the, in the video light, you know, being promoted as, as the messiahs, you know, for the earth. Right? They're all a lie. Men of low degree are vanity. Men of high degree are a lie. Right? All these, all these um, different um, personalities or personas that you see, you know, on, uh, on, on, on your television, in news, you know, these are all created, right? 
they're carefully crafted in order to portray a particular message, right? Matter of fact, the word persona actually comes from, I believe it's, it's either a Greek or a Roman custom of um, when, they, when they're doing plays, you know, different theatrical, uh, um, you know, displays, they would put on different masks, right? To, um, to, to, to represent different, um, different people in those plays. But I thought, let me, let me look it up. If I can get it. Persona. Right, so persona, outward or social personality. Right, it says um, literally character representing the voice of, art, of, of, um, of, of the author. An acceptable person, originally applied to diplomatic representatives acceptable to the governments to which they were sent right so it's an outward or social personality so it's your persona is what you 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 portray to the public right it's not really who you are it's what you portray right so there's a particular image that's pushed for elon musk for trump for biden for whosoever it is that is in the um the, 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 the light of the media there's a particular sauna that is, is, is crafted by their publicists, by their marketing team. It's all a marketing ploy, right? So let me read it again, verse 9. Surely men of low degree are vanity, and men of high degree are a lie. To be laid in the balance, they are altogether lighter than vanity. So these men represent nothing for you, yo. Trust not in oppression, become not vain in robbery. If riches increase, set not your heart up, uh, on them. God, Yahweh, has spoken once, twice, have I heard this, the power, the power belongeth to Yahweh, Baal Shem Yahushai. Right? It says, also unto thee, O Lord, belongeth mercy, for thou renderest every man according to his work. Right? Rain is coming here, let me move quickly. It says, um, Psalm 146 and verse 3, right? It says, um, put not your trust in princes, right? Put not your trust in princes, nor in the son of man in whom there is no help right his breast goes forth returning to the earth again in that very day his thoughts perish happy is he right that hath yahweh the god of jacob for his help whose help is in the lord you know yahweh right so that, that's what we should that's what we should be looking forward to right that should be our help right yahweh ba shem yahushai right not not any mortal man you know which is vain, you know, and we, which which are not even for our turn, you know. These these men are all set up to 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 deceive people and lead them, you know, down a path of, of destruction, lead them right toward the the MOTB. Trump is not against the deep state. Trump is an agent of the deep state. He wouldn't be able to be in this um, position were it not sanctioned by the um, the elites, right? This is Jeremiah 17 and verse 5. Thus saith the Lord, Cursed be the man that trusteth in man, and that maketh flesh his arm, whose heart departed from the Lord. For he shall be like the heath in the, in the desert, right? and shall not see when good cometh, but shall inhabit the parched places in the wilderness, in a salt land and not inhabited. Blessed is the man that trusteth in the Lord, and whose help the Lord is. And even in, you know, in the brother's video, the Elder Quarkum, he was saying that, you know, don't be surprised to see some of these Hebrew Israelite uh, um, groups, you know, promoting Donald Trump, you know, for president, you know, right? But we, you know, the men of GMS, you know, we, we, we are, and the women too who follow, you know, GMS, you know, we should be um, firmly, you know, um, steady on your how about Shemi Shai, right? It says, blessed is the man that trusteth in the Lord and whose hope the Lord is. Yeah, <laughs> Trump ain't gonna save you when, when, the, um, when the time of Jacob's trouble come you, right? For he shall be as a tree planted by the waters that spreadeth out her roots by the river and shall not see when heat cometh, but her leaf shall be green and shall not be careful in the year of drought. That's when what? The famine come, right? The word careful there means anxious, worrying, right? In the year of drought, neither shall cease from yielding fruit, right? Let's get another precept here. We're going to wrap here. I believe so. Oh no, there's another one, right? Uh, Isaiah 30 verse 10, Woe to the rebellious children, right, talking about our people, saith the Lord, that take counsel but not of me, that cover with a covering but not of my spirit, that they may add sin to sin. Yeah, they, they, they're covering with the covering of right, right now, the latest fad is, is Trump, of course, right, that walks to go down into Egypt and have not asked at my mouth, right, which the, the modern day Egypt is what, America, 
right, to strengthen themselves in the strength of Pharaoh and to trust in the shadow of Egypt. Therefore shall the strength of Pharaoh, the strength of Trump, shall be your shame. The trust in the shadow of Egypt, your confusion, right? We're going to wrap here in uh, Isaiah 10 and 20, and this is talking about the remnant, those who have woken up to the truth. This is how we're going to behave, right? And it shall come to pass in that day, what day? The day that we're in right now, right? The last days that the remnant of Israel shall, the remnant of Israel, and such as are escaped out of the house of Jacob shall no more stay, meaning trust, lean upon him that smote them, yeah, which is the enemy, and, and Trump is a part of that, right? He's an Edomite. He's, a, he's a, 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 a part of the nation who is our chief enemy, right? So we shall no more stay upon him that smote them, but shall stay upon the Lord, Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, the Holy One of Israel. The remnant shall return, even the remnant of Jacob unto the mighty power, right? For though my people be of the sand of the sea, right, we're, 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 we're enough, right? Most of us, right, will follow after the ways of this world. Right, it says, yet the remnant shall return, the consumption, the creed shall overflow with righteousness. So hopefully this lesson was edifying. You know, until next time, Shalom.